Bill Hickok. You're the lowest side windingest, crooked shooting dirty varmint to crawl out of a hole and look up at the light. Who you calling dirty? <laughs> I do declare, Janie, you are a sight for sore oculi. Same to you, Bill. Whatever you said. Shashmarillis! Them two know each other? <laughs> like a wolf knows a mountain lion. Still taking candy from babies, Bill? Still bringing justice to the unsung and unappreciative? So, care for a hand? Nope, care for some John. Need to know about what's going on around these parts. Funny things like Army and Comanche doing things they claim they didn't do. Like shooting up towns and shooting up camps? Haven't heard a thing. But you... Of course, I might cogitate something. For a prize. No, I won't quit what I do. But law, man, it ain't proper for a lady. Sometimes you act just like you was my big brother, Bill. And you ain't. Now, we've been over this all before. If you don't want to help me, just say so. Fine. I don't want to help. But I will cut you for it. Beat that, Bill. Hmm. Two of clubs. Ha! Tell me. Bill Doolin and his gang seem to be pretty active near South Fork, bragging about the trouble they've been getting into. Doolin. Love to stay and chat, Bill, but I have some law womaning to do. Come on, Joe, we ride. Hmm. But there were 20 of them and only three of us. You told me we were only going for a ride in the country. This is country, ain't it? Think you can do a girl a favor and keep our company occupied until I'm finished getting ready? Why do I always invite adversity when I'm in your company? Because I make your life interesting. have a valid point, Jane. If we give them the money, they'll stop chasing us. And let them get away with it? You know, we could always go after them later. Maybe when the odds are a little bit more in our favor. No, don't you see that's wrong? Well, someone could get hurt. Yeah, you know, like them. Or me. Bill. Ah, let's just say it's a flesh wound. Don't you worry. We'll find a place to rest right soon. And then I'll have a look at it. Whatever you say. Don't trouble your pretty head. I'm sure it's going to be just fine. Stay awake, Mr. Wild Bill Hickok. Wide awake. You hear me? You're yelling right in my ear. How could I not? Oh, easy there. I'm not dead yet. Ow! That hurts. Don't be such a baby. I gotta stop the bleeding. You don't have to tie it so tight. Can't respirate with it like that. Wild Bill Hickok. The man. The myth. The legendary crybaby. I can't wait to tell everyone when we get out of here. If we get out of here. Oh, we'll get out. What's regoitering mean? And why can't you talk English like the rest of us, instead of using them highfalutin danglers? Just my way, Joe. On my 10th birthday, my pa got me a Colt pistol and a dictionary. He told me to learn them both. And I did. I wondered where some of your $50 words came from. What, like actuality and aluminiferous? What? <laughs> Two of the first words I ever memorized. Had the devil's own time trying to work him into dinner conversation. They'll probably rush us tonight. They want that money, make no mistake. Over my dead body. Or mine. Look, Bill, I... I know. It's against your principles. And I respect you for your high ideals, but... Couldn't you be taking this a bit too far? 
What's right is right. You know, sometimes you're even more stubborn than Joe's mule. I'm not giving up the gold, and that's that. Cut you for it. Oh, anyone for a game of poker? There you go with them words again. <laughs> you take things too seriously, Joe. We've got 20 honorary sidewinders gunning for us, and you two is joking. You both look off, you ask me. What if... What if I make a deal with the outlaws? About time. I'm not giving up the money. I was thinking more of getting them to let you and Joe right away. I'd stay with the money. Doesn't seem like they get much out of the deal. Well, two less marksmen to fight. They'd be 20 to 1, much better odds. <laughs> For them, maybe. Not so sure about you. Quit talking craziness, Janie. I ain't leaving you no how, no way. Wouldn't be right. In for a penny, in for a pound. I stay too. I'm trying to save your lives. I'm not going. Me neither. Of all the mule-headed stubborn things. Besides, what would people say if Wild Bill Hickok left a lady in the lurch? Well, I just couldn't live with myself. Don't agree with your outlook, Jane, but I'll defend you to the end while we argue. You're next, Bill. Ladies, first. You have no condition to lower yourself down, so just get in. I'm trying to save your life. The things you do just to prove a point. was the most absurdly asinine, nonsensical thing I have ever seen. They'd follow otherwise. How many bullets you got left? Not enough to take them all on, if that's what you're thinking. You'll never hit it from here. Hit what? What are you talking about? Hit, hit what? Piece of cake. Yeah, for me, maybe. You think you can shoot better than I can? Say? What are you talking about? I'm the one who hit it. In your dreams, Bill. That was my shot. You are deluding yourself, young lady. Yours was to the left. Barely winged the shack at all. What? Yours was high. Hardly. It was dead on. Hickok, if you weren't feeling so poorly, I'd You'd just... You'd what? You'd what? You aren't fooling anyone. We both know that in the end, you'd give up some of your ideals for your friends. Well, maybe. Only this once. It won't happen again. You know, now that I think about it, perhaps you did hit the mark and blow that shack up. What? You're just saying that because I was willing to save your life. No, no. The sun was in my eyes. I could have been wrong. Could have been. Could have been. See that cactus over there? I can hit the top needle from here. Oh, that's nothing. See that mesquite bush? Third leaf on the left on the bottom? <laughs> that's easy. What about that cattle skull over behind that ravine? Them two? They're both loco. Where is she? Where? I heard I came. Is she feeling poorly? Uh, doctor says not to rile her none. I ain't gonna rile her. Is she bad? <laughs> Calamity Jane. <laughs> <laughs> She ain't so full of calamity anymore, if you ask me, huh? This <laughs> now just. Shane! I'll kill you! Oh, don't 
I understand, all right. And so will he. He'll understand with his last breath. You... you can't kill him, Bill. Can. Will. Watch me. You saw her, saw what he did. I'm helping Jane. Are you? Or are you just helping yourself? And their hearts. He loves Jane in his own way. He just wants to see justice done. Justice? Vengeance, more likely. You be careful, child. Justice ain't worth dying for. No, it's worth dying for. It just ain't worth killing for. Not your place. I thank you for the thought, Bill. Really, I do. But you best be going now. What, so you can be alone and he can hurt you some more? Or worse? He can't hurt me. Not ever again. You must let me do this, Bill. If you care at all what happens to me, I'll live or die, you must 